Hello, this is Joe from MBS Australia. This is a quick demonstration video in MBS Chorus for how to add products using MBS Source. Uh, into the interior specification first. What we're going to look to do is um, add access panels. So first I'm going to filter all the content I've got within the interior specification by just using systems only, or I could do all clauses or products. Uh, one way to find it would be to search through products. And I could see access panels because it's um, ordered in terms of alphabetical order. I find it here. If I had a suffix, I could order from there. In this case, I'll go through the systems because I know it's in the board suspended ceiling systems that I have. So once I enter into that system, some of this is completed for the overall system I'm specifying. I'll scroll down to access panels, which is here. And once I've entered into the actual clause itself by clicking on access panels, it zooms down to where I can start adding information. I can describe what I need from the access panels. What you'll notice here is on the products area, five products under the view manufacturer product information. So the way MBS source works is that you're uh, dragging in some exact information from some of the manufacturers who have signed up to the platform. So for example, if I want to add in the first one here, the Panther access panels, I'll just use the plus sign. If I'm still choosing, I could perhaps click onto one of them. And there's lots of really, really good content added by the MBS team where you can start to read about the product itself, get some information about the company, go a little further down to see what the clause is actually gonna be populated with. So you can see these are all the items that the company would like to have shown. There's further features down here where you can get lots of further information as you need and then if necessary, contact the actual manufacturer. So I'll go back to more products. And as I said, I'll add in the first one with the plus sign. Incredibly handy integration is that that's now automatically populated all of the clause items you'll need for the access panels. It's added all these in. And furthermore, it's parked some of the items that are not necessary, as you can see with the gray line through it. So more and more every week, companies um, sign up to the platform, and that means uh, for various building products, you can access this products tab on the right hand side and just drag in products very easily as you need to. As we discussed before, you can still use the pencil icon to add any further prefix or suffix if you wanted to give any further uh, notation to those so you can then search again quite easily when you're back into your interior spec, finding different systems or products.